Hello and welcome to another in our series of short video tutorials on Video Studio Pro X3, Corel's flagship video editing application that costs less than $100 but does more, faster, and more intuitively than others costing hundreds more. In this particular tutorial, I want to show you how to correct one of the most common yet most frustrating errors to fix in video editing. I'm talking about rotating a misaligned video clip. I truly think this has happened to everyone who has used a camera with video capabilities, especially the pocket sized ones. We are so accustomed to taking both landscape and portrait oriented photos that we easily forget that the video shooting feature of a photo camera is really only for shooting landscape oriented, that is, horizontal videos. Why? Because it seems there's no easy solution to rotating it back into a landscape orientation. Don't believe me? Well, Google the term rotate video clip and notice how many people are looking to fix this issue. Many applications seem to have the capability to fix this error, but the fact that very few people know how to do it in the software they're using doesn't bode well for the intuitiveness of their video editing application. Let me show you where you can fix this in Video Studio, as there are many locations. Launch Video Studio Pro X3 and pause at the launcher here. If you're not familiar with these separate applications that come in Video Studio Pro, there are several other tutorials on this website that will help you get acclimated. I will say though that each of these four applications has the ability to one-click rotate a video clip in 90 degree increments. Launch Burn. I'll locate a video clip that has this issue because yes, I've also made this mistake. It doesn't matter whether this clip is in the organizer here, in the media tray at the bottom, or in the DVD menu or timeline area on the way to your output choice, double click it to take the clip to the video editing window like this. Your rotate tool is right over here. Just choose the correct orientation and click it. And that's all there is to it. Click the back icon to go back to the organizer and notice it's actually created a new clip without replacing the old one. And now I Bring this down and add it now to my video tray. Let me now jump into Easy Edit and show the consistent interface where you can locate the same tool in the same places. I can fix the same clip the same way I did before, but let me show you where else it can be done. This time I'll drag the clip to the media tray. If I double click it here, it will also launch the clip into the editor where I can make the same change. I'll go back. Under Create, I'll choose Movie and click go to movie. And yes, I can double click the offending clip here too and go to where I can fix it. Now I'll try the advanced editor. And then again, there are my rotate clip options. So as you can see, rotating a video clip in Video Studio Pro really doesn't get any easier. Where it can be difficult or require additional software to accomplish this elsewhere, the feature is omnipresent in Video Studio Pro X3. Thanks again, and we'll see you in the next Corel video tutorial.